Dear friends, good morning. Now, to get little more perfection in the problems related to trigonometry up to transformations, we do this problem. Let us move into the problem. If a, B, C are angles in a triangle. Prove that cos 2A minus cos 2B plus cos 2C equal to 1 minus 4 sin A cos B sin C. What is the hypothesis given? A, B, C are angles in a triangle. We know that sum of 3 angles is 180. So given A plus B plus C equal to 180. Take LHS and we prove RHS. So LHS is cos 2A minus cos 2B plus cos 2C. Now, I shall make use of first and second terms treating 2A as C and 2B as D. If you treat like this, you can see the formula cos C minus cos D. So I have written the formula cos C minus cos D minus 2 sin c plus d by 2 sin c minus d by 2. In the formula you are having c and d whereas in the problem you are having 2a and 2b. So replace 2a and 2b here. So it become minus 2 sin 2a plus 2b by 2 into sin 2a minus 2b by 2. Third part remains the same plus cos 2c. How we got this step? In the place of c, you have to write 2a. In the place of d, you have to write 2b. By writing like that, we get this step. Next step, split this 2 to the numerator. So minus 2 sin 2a by 2 plus 2b by 2 into sin 2a by 2 minus 2b by 2 plus cos 2c. So I don't disturb third part. Cancel after cancellation, the remaining is minus 2 sin a plus b into sin a minus b plus cos 2c. According to the hypothesis, it is already given a plus b plus c is 180. We have to use this hypothesis for two times. Very first time, a plus B to make it in terms of C we can write A plus B equal to 180 minus C into the remaining is as it is sin A minus B plus cos 2C 180 minus comes in which quadrant second quadrant in second quadrant sin is positive positive so plus minus into plus is minus after removal of 0 18 is even so there is no change in the ratio sin so sin what is the angle here c so minus 2 sin c into sin a minus b plus 
if you observe here at c you are having a sign at c you are having sign so here cos 2a cos 2a you have to use such a formula for cos 2a because for cos 2a we are having four formula one formula is 1 minus 2 sin square a the other formula is 2 cos square a minus 1 the other one is cos square a minus sin square a and the third is I mean last one is 1 minus tan square a by 1 plus tan square a this is all these are all the formula for cos 2a of these uh, four formulae which formula you have to use that is important here by looking here c is in terms of sign c is in terms of sign so you have to express this c term in terms of sign in terms of sign so what is the formula having only in terms of sign this is the formula you are having only in terms of sign so cos 2a 1 minus 2 sin square a if it is cos 2c 1 minus 2 sin square c so the same I have written 1 minus 2 sin square c suppose 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 here if it is in terms of cos c is in terms of cos then which formula you have to select formula having only cos so this formula you have to select Yes, in our problem, C is in terms of sign. Hence, I have selected this formula as 1 minus 2 sin square C. How many terms we are having? This is one term. This is a second term. This is a third term. Three terms we are having. So, write this term separately in the beginning so i have written plus one in the beginning so this is over remaining two terms remaining two terms in these two terms if you observe what is common minus two sin c minus two sin c in both the terms you are having minus two sin c common so take minus 2 sin c common after taking minus 2 sin c common what is remaining i have written the c term in the beginning if you take minus common the remaining symbol become plus if you take minus common the sign the symbol remained is plus because plus into minus is minus so removal of minus as common the remaining is 2 is in common sin square one sign is in common the remaining extra is sin c <coughs> as i said minus if you take common the remaining symbol is plus so plus sin a minus b here for second time you have to use the hypothesis a plus b plus c equal to 180 to convert this c again in terms of a and b so c equal to 180 minus of a plus b the remaining term as it is 1 minus 2 sin c 180 minus theta this is a theta 180 minus comes in second quadrant second quadrant sign is positive so plus nothing is written so you have to treat it as plus 
remove 0. 18 is even. So, sin remains sin. Sin, what is the theta here? A plus B. Plus sin A minus B. Direct formula here. You can see sin A plus B plus sin A minus B. Formula is 2 sin A cos B. This is a direct formula. Sin A plus B plus sin A minus B. Formula is 2 sin A cos B. In between these two, you are having multiplication. So multiply these two. 1 minus 2 into 2, 4 sin A cos B sin C. Which is our required RHS. Hence, the problem is over. If we are thorough in learning the formulae, if you are thorough in the formulae, these problems are very easy, which are important essay answers. So, at a glance, if you observe, in the beginning, you have to treat 2A as C and 2B as D. Next, apply the formula of cos C minus cos D. Next, splitting the denominator. If there is anything gets cancelled, cancel it. Make use of the hypothesis to convert A plus B in terms of C. Apply appropriate formula. Later, check what is common in the terms. Take it as common. In the next, make use of the hypothesis a second time to convert C in terms of A plus B. Again, use the appropriate formula. At last, we will get our required RHS. Hence, proved. So, problem is over.